Are you making moves or are you making progress? Hey, hey, creatives, it is me, Garjan, it's the Page Princess, and that's the question for you. So about two days ago, I had a business consult and my client was just telling me all of the different businesses she was doing. And, oh, I do, I do this and I do that and I do this. And I had to stop her because you are making so many moves, but are you progressing in any of those businesses that you have opened? And that is my question for you today, creatives. How many things are you doing? And something has to be suffering because you cannot give five things 100%. So let's talk about this. So like between 2008 and 2012, I was tripping. I was literally killing myself and didn't even realize it. I had hair shows, I had magazines, I had a summer camp, I had my salon. I was doing so many things and not making much progress in any of them, just making move after move after move after move. And listen, I see this all the time, y'all. So you are not alone. If you are one of those that have five different businesses because it looks good, it looks cute, it looks like you're making moves, it looks like you're successful, sis, you have to slow down. You have to focus on one thing at a time. What is your passion? What can gen What's generating money effortlessly? Let's focus on that first. So once you prioritize and get that in check, then you can probably start adding on because see what happens is this. Listen to me clearly. So you have one business that's doing well, that's successful. So you're taking the profits from that business and investing in the other business and the other business and the other business. Then after you have invested the profits from the business that's really actually making the money, then you have no money because you have invested in five other businesses that you're trying to get off the ground. And now what? You're stressed out because where's the money? I know I made a ton of money over here, but where is it? And so this business is kind of trying to do something. This other business ain't really doing much, but it's cute. Sis, slow down, prioritize, rewind, plan. You cannot give three, four, five businesses 100% of your time and attention. You need to get that one business profitable, generating, then take and invest in another business but you have to prioritize first. Just listen, everything that's big was once small. And if you take your time and you plan and you work on it, you can have your main business and other businesses that's generating income, but you have to plan, you have to prioritize, you have to focus on one thing at a time, sis. Peace.